Today we're going to read a one-off letter from Mrs. Mary G. Brown, Newton Falls, in Trumbull County, Ohio, dated January 1864 from Washington, D.C. Saturday evening, 7 o'clock, all old women and children once again i am with the boys at the regiment or with who is not on a scout i got here last evening about two hours after cook was glad to receive your letter and to hear from you by one that i had seen so recently you all we had a gaily old time coming th flaunting through the mud and the flooded creeks that had been raised by the late rain was on the way three days. You say I must not embellish. Don't you think that seven or eight hundred dollars would just be what we want to put out of the debt without, I mean, with out joking I would like the money and but if I should and the war did not come to an end within the year you would think that I had done another great song to my family and perhaps do we have enough to sell I hardly think it will last that long but hardly dare risk it for the one I shall be glad that the time for the reenlistment is over. I'm sorry that so much endangerment was ever offered. About three fourths of the regiment have been sworn in and new and now the other quarry is what will be done with the rest. I suppose the regiment will soon go to Ohio to stay the rest of the winter. I will not write you much of a letter tonight. We'll write you again soon. You must be thankful for the small favors as ever yours, J. Brown. Side note, can't hear anything of my satchel. Sunday, 3 o'clock, all is well.